Hey Highlander fans, Mike Ventola with you here on the Highlander Sports Network. And I'm very excited to have with me Milena Baish, of course, a recent graduate of NJIT and also to a recent member of the women's basketball program here at NJIT. MB, first and foremost, thank you so much for joining me. And secondly, how have you been doing throughout this quarantine process? Thank you for having me. I have to say I'm adjusting. I'm still adjusting. I'm in quarantine. We are in quarantine for almost two months, but it is what it is. I'm using this time to work on myself, prepare for finals that they're already passed and preparing for new roles in, in my life. You know, and you talk about some of the roles that you're preparing for. We'll get to that in just a moment. But when you think about your time at NJIT and, you know, um, think of, you know, the past few years, whether it be on the playing court or whether it be in a classroom, uh, is there a specific moment that, st that stands out to you that you really will look fondly back on? I would not say there's a specific moment because my NGIT career was full of tremendous moments and ex amazing experiences I had with people uh, in general. I would love to say our first game in WEC, brand new WEC, it was amazing. And again, our last game in WAC, it was amazing. So I had to, I had to close it with that one. <laughs> <laughs> no, which is great too. And that's what I mean. You can remember, um, you know, when the WAC opened. And of course, you're of the last regime that was even a part of the old uh, Fleischer Athletic Center. And, you know, um, I guess if you were to give a message to future, you know, basketball players or any future athletes that'll, you know, call the WAC home, um, what about, the WEC itself that you would tell athletes, like, this is what you're going to enjoy most about this awesome arena. I would say utilize every single room in that WEC, from practice courts, main gym, athletic uh, facility, whole, 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 using strength and conditioning room, medical room, everything, every single little inch of it. Because once you, you leave, you will miss every single appointment you miss you will miss every single <laughs> you'll miss your trainers i would say a lot i was about to say i'm and sure you know right we're like, we are like three months out and i already miss trainers <laughs> so you, miss, you miss bobby too obviously in the strength and conditioning uh Absolutely. staff so yeah, definitely. um definitely. And just stopping just stopping in asking for extra workout it was I would definitely say I'm going to miss that the most. Right, too. And, you know, um, now that, you know, your career at NJIT has come to a close, and now it's it's really interesting because normally in this situation it would be okay, on to the next, you know, venture, which you're looking to do, but you're stuck at home now because of this quarantine. You know, we got a brand new job, getting ready to start your career. Tell us a little bit about what your new job is and what will it entail. So in late January, I got an offer from a uh, company called, called RiskVolve. Uh, I accepted it on the spot, and it's a company that has industry-leading analytics solution, uh, which mainly helps traders uh, build strategic uh, and uh, build their strategies and generate revenue on their investments. Uh, as someone who had their, her master's in finance and later com now completed my um, master's focus my master's on financial technology this is just great uh great great place for me because i will be product support analyst i will work with clients directly so it's i'm really excited for the opportunity and i know that basketball and generally athletic life uh, prepared me for for this because it will be a lot of learning a lot of adapting and in general that's that's whole life and that's what basketball prepared prepared me for for those who are unaware of where it may be located, you know, is it, would you be reporting into New Jersey or will you be going to work in New York when the dust settles with this uh, quarantine process? Yes. So my, my offices are located in New York City, actually between 6th and 7th Avenue on 33rd Street. So looking at time zones, I will, I'm, I'll be working from home until everything settles down. But once I'm back in a city, that will be my location. You know, um, once everything does settle down and you get the opportunity to go into the offices and beginning to really uh, get your feet on the ground in regards to your new job. Um, and then also, too, on the other side, once, you know, 
hopefully sports and everything gets a chance to resume um, at the WEC and even the other facilities around NJIT. Uh, Highlander fans want to know, will MB come back and visit um, at some point? Of course. Of course. I, I'm i still waiting. I'm still checking all websites. Do they have any updates on season? Because I really want to see girls be back in the gym and I really want to see I'm not coming back as a practice player not yet <laughs> but I want to see I want to see I want to see girls back and I want to see them have fun so I'll definitely be there again working full time working Monday to Friday I will see to catch double headers I will see to catch as many games home games as I I'll be able to but definitely looking forward to that well when when basketball especially resumes um, at the WEC, I can promise you we'll have a seat right next between me me, and whether it be David Goss or Dave Calloway, and you can sit with us if you want to offer some commentary. We'd welcome it. So, you know, because of what you were able to do on the court. So uh, would you be open to that? I'm throwing you on the spot here. Okay. I accept it. <laughs> we have a recording of this. So, okay, we can always remind it. <laughs> gonna, we're going to hold you to it, but uh, MB, thank you so much for joining me. Uh, congratulations on what was an, uh, an awesome career for you at NJIT. Great years for you, and uh, like you said, we look forward to seeing you at the WEC uh, when the doors are back open. Thanks for having me. It's it's always a pleasure, you know it. Yeah, certainly do. So for, for all of you Highlander fans, that's MB. I'm Mike Ventola. Thanks for watching.